coming this fall. Introducing a new pair of Zero Shoes, the 360. Zero Shoes has specialized in minimalist footwear with highly flexible soles. And with the 360 asphalt, it is no different. These soles are highly flexible, but where others have been for running, hiking, or just casual, these are made for parkour, crossfit, gym, rope climbing, type of activity. These are sleek with rubber grip on the top of the toes. The shoelacing system really locks in your foot for a secure fit. With a vegan suede microfiber for a reinforced toe, they're made for all your scuffing desires. Not only versatile, but lightweight with a men's size nine coming in at only 9.2 ounces. The Zero 360 is a shoe I got for free for an honest review. The Zero 360 is a good shoe. I've used it for functional strength training, yoga and gym-like activities. I still have plenty of flex in the shoe. So any of those positions where I'm trying to move my foot around, still plenty of movement. There is a bit more of a foundational feel. Just to say I'm, I have a good sturdy foundation when I have these on, so when I'm doing my squats, I, I feel like I have a good solid foundation. It feels a bit thicker than my other Zero shoes and I don't know if that's just the flatness that's here or the running shoes typically have more of a rounded edge to it. So this again is more for your gym-like activities, your parkour. Um, I would be a little cautious with parkour uh, just for any type of slipping that could go on here. Uh, it has a grip, but it's not exactly slip resistant. I do like the reinforced toe and these rubber strips to uh, just give it a little bit more traction if I was going to climb a rope or I guess scuff up against something. There's still this same lock-in Hirachi inspired type lacing system that always works great with Zero. And you still have this scuffing type material, this microfiber suede, vegan suede material at the back of the shoe on the heel as well. Bit of a screen type mesh here, but you can't see through the shoe. This mesh does have a durable feel. And as always, if you want that more of a minimalist feel, you can always take out the insole. All in all, it's a good minimalist foundation shoe. It's got some reinforcements on it and could really put some wear and tear in the gym, CrossFit. Uh, that's where I'm gonna be using mine at the gym and functional strength training. So if you're looking for these, hope you enjoy them. Pick up some 360 Zero shoes.